Well, Jay the Youngin is on that same project. How close were you guys? Man, like I said, I don't really get close to a lot of rappers, but he done been in my home. You know what I'm saying? Like, we can talk. That I actually talked to him like two, three hours before that happened. We were scheduled to shoot the video. That's what, that's actually why I shot the free throw video. We was actually supposed to shoot something that week. Um, it's just that was my little dog, man. Yeah, I did one of his uh, one of his first interviews. You know, it wasn't his first interview, but it was like maybe like his second or third interview. And, uh, well, I mean, listen, he, he had drug issues as well. Uh, I mean, he basically said that he's on perks during the interview and he had to stop the interview to go throw up. Yeah. You know, like in my, in my lobby, essentially. But then he got it back together and, you know, he... Uh, yeah, he was getting himself together. Yeah, he got himself back together. He finished the interview off. And, you know, I got to see him grow and, and become a bigger artist. And he went to jail for a while. And then he got out and it seemed like, okay, he he's back on his grind and he had a real fan base and he had a real talent. And then when you, when you found out what happened, uh, that July, he got ambushed by, by five, five guys. Uh, his dad was shot twice himself. He ended up, you know, returning fire. But after the smoke cleared, his son was dead right there at his house. Uh, when you found out that happened and you had just spoken to him a couple hours before, what did you think? Man, at that moment, uh, um, I don't know, bro, because I, I, I had just talked to him. So when they were posting it, I didn't believe it. I was just blowing everybody's phone up. They were keeping me updated, and I knew he was fighting it, you know, trying to fight it. But mm, I don't know. I can't explain the feeling, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like I say, I don't get close to a lot of people. So if I, I build a relation with, with shit with you, I, re I really fuck with you. You know what I'm saying? I got your back. And... You always, I guess, I guess, I always feel like it's more I could tell people, or if I knew the situation, because like I never knew that he was. I knew he was on house arrest, but I didn't know he was house arrest there, at this particular house. You know what I'm saying? And and I would have just tried to talk to him about just being better, way more on game. You know what I'm saying? Uh, cause it's like, like I say, sometimes all like I I be needing to be reminded to be on game. Sometimes I'm slipping. You feel me? I be need everybody be needing that. So. I wish I could have been there and and delivered that to him. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I mean, rest in peace, uh, Jay the Younger, man. It was, uh, like I said, it was a dude that had some problems, but it seemed like he was getting over his problems. It seemed like he had gone through some issues, but he was getting over it, and he was still focused on his career. And because yeah, I had still talked to him, him. when well, he got for, for for his gun charge and stuff, I'm like, bro, you got blissed. He's like, yeah, you're right. I'm like, bro, you really got blissed. So you know. Go on here, take this, get over the, the couple month papers, and go on here and you know what I'm saying, go for a drive. You feel me? And, and that was the game plan. Like we all we were supposed to drop a tape together. Really? Oh man. Well, yeah, man. I, I just got to interview him one time. That was our only interaction. Uh, you were obviously a lot closer to him, and I'm sorry for your loss. That's sad. Well, I remember in uh in July of uh 2022, uh you said you're single until you get over your crush, who was uh Regine Carter. Yeah. Is that still your crush? Nah, I'm over it. You're over it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm over it. I'm over it. She 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 very beautiful though, but you know she in a relationship, and I'm not a, really a type to disrespect with a relationship. You know what I'm saying? I don't have no problems with her, dude. Or nothing like that. Um, I actually, uh, I've actually been trying to get in contact with them because I got a song that's gonna come out on one of my next albums where I say her name. So like, when that happens, I like to contact them. Be like, and because I don't like changing shit, so I want I gotta contact them, let them know that it's a, that's an old verse. Okay, what do you say in the verse? I say these hoes want my attention, but but they don't look half as good as Regine. Okay. Yeah. O okay. That's yeah, what it I'm is. over that crush now, though. I'm over it. You're over it. All right. Fair I enough. Got, I got some new ones now. 